Dash stands for non-alcoholic steatohepatitis. And what that really means is the presence of fat in the liver associated with inflammation, with or without scarring, which we call fibrosis. NASH and in the wider spectrum of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, which we call NAFLD for short, has become a major public health problem in the U.S. with the current estimates of about 90 million Americans suffering from this, of which approximately 5% will have NASH or the progressive form of fatty liver disease that can sometimes lead to cirrhosis. So the current estimates are that by 2020, this will be the most common reason for liver transplant in the U.S. There are three steps in the evaluation of patients with NASH. The first step is to define the specific etiology or cause for fatty liver disease, since many other conditions can cause fat accumulation in the liver, such as excessive alcohol use or some varieties of hepatitis C infection. The second step in the evaluation process is to define how much damage there is to the liver, what we call fibrosis or scarring of the liver. And the third step is to define the best treatment option for any specific patient. And our philosophy is that patients with NASH require an integrated comprehensive treatment involving many different specialists. So in our clinic, when patients come in, they get evaluation and a management plan, sometimes on the same visit, because they have a chance to meet with a liver specialist, a dietitian, an endocrinologist, as well as research coordinators sometimes. So this re leads to shortening of the time to diagnosis, to their risk stratification, as well as a comprehensive long-term management plan. So at the UPMC Flow Clinic, we offer several advantages. One is that we follow patients lifelong, since NASH is a disease that's chronic and most individuals will need to be monitored and treated lifelong. We also have a commitment to very closely coordinate with their own treatment teams, with their primary physicians and community endocrinologists. So we have a very close bond and cooperation with our referring physicians in the community hospitals. And finally, we have an excellent support system in the form of world-class radiology and pathology. And for those individuals who have very advanced liver disease, one of the world's premier liver transplant programs.